Hey everybody! How are you doing today? So I wanted to do an angel card. I've been having requests for these so I'm going to go ahead and pull a couple out of there today. What do we need? What do we need? All right, raise your vibration. A lot going on in that card. Let's take a look. It's time to move up a level. It's time to fly high. You may have experienced some setbacks or felt low recently, but that is behind you now and you have the opportunity to light up like never before. Everything in the entire universe is comprised of energy, and that energy vibrates, drawing towards it similar energy. So raising your vibration means aligning yourself with situations, people, places, and choices that you know will lift you up, support you, and help you grow. When this card appears, you have overcome the darkness and are moving into a time of opportunity. Like a phoenix rising up from the ashes, you can be reborn. Know that angels are acknowledging your commitment to growth. You are filled with inspiration now and attracting only good. There's a sense of achievement around you at this time. You may be receiving documentation, certification, or a reward of some description to acknowledge your growth or experience. This is a time to cherish, a time to enjoy the rewards of your commitment to living with integrity and doing good. You have overcome many challenges and risen above adversity, judgment, and possibly even abuse. You are ascending spiritually and personally at this time, and the universe is supporting you. This is a pathway of light, the pathway of your soul's evolution, ascension. Yes, I know so many people that have experienced so many really hard things and made it through and also figured out how to go ahead and use that in order to help someone else that's going through the same thing. So that is the beautiful part of it. I mean, there's always something about it that's good, even though it's really hard. Um, I'm going to go ahead and give you the other one that just flew out, forgiveness and understanding. Sometimes we have to forgive ourselves even for things. I mean, forgiveness and understanding goes for others, but also for ourselves. We, no one's perfect. We all learn and then we move forward from there. As soon as you see the word forgiveness, you'll know where this energy is needed in your life. Forgiveness is a correction to human vision, an opportunity to see through the eyes of the soul. And ultimately, it gives us an idea of what's, what it's like to see through the eyes of our angels. Whatever the situation that feels heavy on your heart right now, when this card appears, your angel guide is inviting you to release it. You aren't being asked to accept bad behavior or let it go, but to realize that the only person who's truly being affected by your unforgiving thoughts and feelings is you. You don't deserve to have past events get in the way of present happiness, and that can only happen if you make space by releasing painful experiences from your heart. So call in your angels and ask them to help you step into the energy of forgiveness. Even if you feel you don't know how to forgive, the willingness to do it will be enough. Yes. Can't say enough about it. I have a meditation that I did on forgiveness, and I will put that at the end of this video. I hope there's no advertisements on it, but it is a very nice, um, really nice meditation with Reiki. So I'll put that at the end of this video. And I'm just going to send out to our hearts for a moment. If there's anybody that you want to think about as far as trying to have forgiveness in your heart for, sometimes. We just need to realize that everybody's human and we can forgive the person. We don't forgive necessarily what happened, but we're forgiving the person for being human. And that helps a lot to open up our hearts. Just going to ground that in. And I hope you guys have a wonderful day and I'll be back again tomorrow. Thanks for joining me.